Stone the Brim. What's up, nigga? Yeah, he was in here. Why y'all making rules with my name in it? What's up? Y'all ain't saying nothing there? I thought we had a discussion earlier. I thought we had a discussion earlier to keep my name out of niggas' mouth. What's going Crickets? on? Crickets. Ain't no crickets. Hey, yo, what? That's 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 whoever whoever. No, they. Like you, I said, you know what? Bro. You know, hey, war. You know what? I had a whole discussion with Reek earlier, man, and said, "Keep my name out of niggas' mouth, man. I ain't I ain't participating in whack fuckery." And and here and here we are back again, my nigga. Like, come on, bro. The nigga been calling hey. me, room to hey, room, searching hey, for me on this that. motherfucker. I don't play with other niggas, my nigga. I don't play with men, my nigga. Hey, 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 Ward, look, right? That's that bullshit. Ain't nobody talking because you it, Reek ain't here and Wack ain't here. So until they come or feel they want to talk, niggas know who to talk to. Niggas been calling the hood. Niggas running makes on niggas. Niggas know who, who real. Niggas know what's popping. On you the game, man. That shit, that shit horrible, bro. How niggas call the niggas homies at all the way in L.A., nigga? Listen, like, since come they ain't on, got bro. nothing to say without their daddy Hold here. Hold up. Why show. they not talking? Why they not talking? What's popping? And wait, we know what the homie said? Wait, 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 yeah, wait, I know wait, him. Wait, That's wait, the homie. Wait, wait, wait. Where was this energy? Hold on, hold on. One mic. Stop acting like we... That's the FHN, homie. What's happening? Hold on, hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And he hung the phone up because he ain't like what he was hearing. Yo, my nigga, take my title, bro. Take my nigga. I ain't changing it wrong. I ain't, I ain't changing the room, or it's not me. You say what? I said, who, did, I, who is it, though? I, this whoever inspired the room, bro. We waiting on them to come into the room. Yo, bro, boom this shit, bro. Do me a favor, bro. Cause um, this ain't this ain't got shit to do with motherfucking social media right now, my nigga. For real though, niggas going too far, my nigga. When you start calling my hood, my set, nigga. That ain't, that, ain't, that, ain't, that ain't social media shit. And I don't think y'all really want to get involved in that. I'm keeping it gangster with you. Like, do, do me a favor. Boom this shit. For real, though. Damn, yo, I'm surprised at y'all, though, man. On some real shit. This is real corny shit right here. Like, seriously, y'all put the nigga name in the title. Y'all got niggas here waiting for y'all to express and to um, actually be Yo, Shaq, what, did you not hear that somebody somebody put the name in the title? Nobody here put the name in the title. So we're not going to speak on something that we're not privy to. So hey, let, let me say this. Let me say something. Stop talking. Let me say something. I ain't got nothing to do with what's us. going on. Let, let me say something. You know let what I mean? Say, You're me... just talking too much. Hold now, up, hold talking, up, hold saying, up. Saying, like, corny shit, corny shit. Nothing's corny, my boy. You just got to relax and wait and wait for the people look, that want to talk. Five, 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 speak, man. Hey, look. Uh, hopefully, we'll be able to get war back. Let me say this. Now, I don't agree with the title. I agree with the cause of the title. Because I believe that the issue is we got two homies that's having an issue. So we need to bring it to the platform so that they can hash out their issue so they can come back together. So once again, the name of the title, even though it's not important, I don't agree with the name, but I do agree with the purpose of the name. They need to be here to, to hash out their differences because this way it was created. It was created on Clubhouse. It need to be resolved on Clubhouse. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, whether the homie called the brim hood to ask about a homie, man, that's, 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 that's nothing. That's always happening. I told everybody, call my neighborhood and ask about me. You're supposed to do that. You're supposed to check who's who, if you got a question about that. But I truly believe that the issue is not even that important. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully war can come back, you know what I'm saying? And he can address the issue. However you're going to address the issue, but it ain't got nothing to do with, the big homies on the streets is mad about this and mad about that. That's a bunch of bullshit. I done been in contact, you know what I'm saying, with the heavy hitters from Brims from the last couple of days. You know what I'm saying? So, so the issue is not an issue other than the homie feel hurt that his that he felt that, that his uh, loyalty to Brims was questioned and the homie called the Brim neighborhood. But that's that's and that's what we do. 
You understand? I call neighborhoods every day asking about motherfuckers because you don't you never know. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, I don't agree with the name of the title of the room, but I agree with the purpose of the room. And, you know, they need to get it and get it going. All right. So what y'all saying? Y'all called, y'all checked on homie Brent status? Stats, right. like we said, bro. And I don't know. Hold up, it ain't no y'all. Wait, said. look, look, let's 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 clarify this. Oh. It ain't no y'all. Y'all didn't do nothing. The homie know who called, why he called, whatever the case may be. So it ain't y'all. Y'all didn't do it. Y'all didn't put the title up here. Y'all not questioning the homie status and none of that. It's two individuals that got whatever issue it is, and they just need to work it out. And two individuals as homies, and they just need to work it out. And once again, nobody on this stage. Facts, Popeye. Thank nobody you, Popeye. Nobody on this stage. The people that have something to do with when they come into the room, y'all can ask all the questions y'all want to. And I've been saying it since the jump. So for y'all to say this shit corny because y'all know, no, hey, like Popeye said, it ain't y'all, nigga. Nah, T Rose. I'm, hey, I'm trying to say what time they coming. What time they coming, T Rose? Bro, listen, we waiting just like you, bro. We, oh. we waiting. I'm, I'm trying to see. I got my popcorn, my butter popcorn ready and everything. Okay. My bad. My bad. My bad. This nigga say he got the butter on the popcorn. That's your butter, bro. Hey, that was a troll, bro. I had I had to click on their profile, yo. So look, they got the whack 100 thing, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. So I'm like, 1, yo, that is that's whack. Crazy. And then I clicked on it. That shit said 1,000. I felt stupid as hell, yo. Yeah, I'm mad as hell. I even clicked. Nah, I caught that. I caught that one. <laughs> but yeah, bro. I'm glad you caught it, dog. Shit, yeah, no, I, I caught that felt, shit. I felt dumb as hell. Like, mm. damn, where you at, huh? And I looked at it like, oh wow. What's <laughs> good, whack 1,000? <laughs> I just <laughs> called this little nigga unk, dog. Yeah, now he probably laughed at you, King. I ain't gonna judge. Yeah, he probably did, yo. He probably said, he probably give me the bean, did. too. Hey, nah, he would have had it right nah. over. I would have to hear the voice first. But no, <laughs> shit. Hey, listen, bro. But but yeah, but we all chilling. We all waiting just like everybody. Shit. I, I'm trying to hear what's going on. As well. The shit Popeye said. The shit Popeye said. No, nobody in this room knew about it. I ain't know. Shit, I'm waiting to hear that shit. I just came in. What we waiting on? We waiting on uh, Wack and Water come back and, you know, Reed. We just, we, we chilling, bro. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, okay. God. The room what's just opened. What's up, That's Mac? Open. Happy birthday, AK. What's the deal? Bro? What's the deal, gang? Thank you. Oh, yeah. Burning in the We're house. Chilling. Creep, creep. Oh, God. What's happening, B Mac? Sleepless gang. Who is that? Big? Today's my birthday. Belly in the Yo, Big what's Chuck. What's up? Big what's Chuck in the building. What's Big Chuck in the building. What's happening, Kev? Yeah, bro, we just chilling. Shit. Oh Happy shit, Bullet Gotti in here. But it's Gotti in the. Oh, Bullet's in here too. Thank Bring you. Bullet. I can't see shit. It's too many people. Oh no. Okay. What's T Rose? What's popping? Yo, T Rose, man. Go. I want What's you to. I'm about to back channel you, T Rose. I want you to put this video up. For everybody in the room, bro, don't let don't let it this... be nothing crazy, bro. Because it's already nah, 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 nah. nah, nah, nah. I want them to see somebody get punished, man. I want people see, boys, to let niggas know the me. shit I was saying right. about you mm -hmm. yesterday. <laughs> oh no, I'm gonna I'm I'm pin. Yeah, pin that link, man. I want everybody to go see that, man. You can't do that when there's videos of you being punished yeah, already, though. Yeah, you gonna see that video at the top, man. Just go look at. Nah, fuck that video. You go, Doc. You See go. What happens when he come in that intro? Yo, T Rose, man. You know, man. I fuck this. That that intro right there be strong. Mama, salute, <laughs> salute to the room, man. Please man, go check out that intro. I'm an imposing. Salute to everybody in the building, though. No, I feel like this room will be a little bit too dark. Let me go ahead and drink some holy water for niggas. Mm -mm. What's up, Charles? How you What's doing? Good, Erica? Good, Erica. How you doing? Hey, hey Erica. What up? Are you ready to take a hey, shot? Erica. B, what's the what's deal? Up, Mackie? Shot up. Hell yeah. And then with Ooh, it, take a shot. You had a good day? Yes, it's been cool. Just still working. Yeah, yeah. AK, how you feeling? I'm good. I'm ready to take a shot you with y'all. <laughs> man, she was talking to me last night. You That's the camera, man. <laughs> Not no money you ran in your pockets. <laughs> Yo, what up, my nigga? The champ is here. Oh, gosh. What up, uh? 
Yeah. Oh, no. Nice. What up, Wack? <laughs> I'm going to address a bunch of motherfucking lies, my nigga. Yeah. I'm oh, shit. Wack, let me find out you chasing people off the ass. He was. <laughs> Listen, my nigga. Niggas over here lying, <laughs> talking about I'm calling and all. Nigga, ain't no. First of all, I didn't made it clear a million times. Wack. I do not involve myself in Crippin' Blood politics once it leave the West Coast. Take that how you want to take it. I don't want to be involved in your politics, how you throw your gang signs, what you believe, what you eat. That's your business. I ain't got nothing to say about it. I ain't going to say it's right. I ain't going to say it's wrong. That's your shit. Now, what niggas got to understand is Wack is a real person. I keep telling niggas I've been doing this street shit actively for 32 motherfucking years, which means we talking about not only in the world, but the streets, the ghettos, juvenile halls, McLaren halls, juvenile camps, youth authorities, penitentiaries, you name it. So when you got a guy like that, that's still standing, He's authentic. So when you say certain shit, niggas going to run a check. So all that happened was this nigga sends me a text message talking about how's M-Rock, right? Now, fuck the name M-Rock. I know Michael Walton. When we didn't have mustaches or nothing, run around fucking Silmar Ju Juvenile Hall, right? So I call my nigga M-Rock. Rock, what's up with this nigga War Brill? Why this nigga asking? Actually, I'm lying. I call him. Why are you at war? Why are you asking me how's M Rock? Like you know the homie. Oh man, well he said you called him and brought me up. Oh yeah, hold on. Call M Rock. You know this nigga War Brill? Oh, that nigga was on my phone the other day with Deuce M's. I guess that's Lamonte. Okay, why is this nigga talking about I called you with his name? He say, nigga, we don't talk about New York niggas. Oh, six dudes brim, nigga, you ain't nobody. He good at him. You ain't nobody, nigga. We ain't talking about, we don't even know you, nigga. No, you do know, no, I don't know you. Me and Wack go back 32 years. He talked to him, get at him. As M. Rock Wood. <clears throat> it's my nigga, ain't nobody talked about you, my nigga. Who said somebody talked about you? So I know M. Rock, M. Rock probably called Lamonte. Hey, my nigga, you call this nigga and said such and such, <clears throat> Lamonte, Probably know damn well he ain't went to mention War Brim name. War Brim probably just didn't call me and threw itself in it. Lamonte probably didn't got on his bumper. Next thing you know, he called it um, Reek. Now, what he didn't know is I had Reek on the phone when I called M Rock, running the background check on Lamonte. Lamonte, check out. He said, Yeah, that's the homie Deuce Sims from Fruit Town Brim. He a solid homie. Boom, boom, boom. We don't never talk about no fucking war brim. I'm not finna talk. What the fuck? Nigga, you all claiming brims from New York and you live in South Carolina. Nigga, it's no relevance to talk about you to a nigga I've been doing this street shit with for 32 fucking years. You're not relevant to the conversation. Once he stamps Lamonte, my respect level went up to Lamonte. Because if the homie stamped him, then it, it, it must be real. You ain't part of that conversation, bro. At all. I don't know when Brims came to be over there, but I guarantee you it wasn't in 88, 89. I'm willing to bet that. Nah, it wasn't. It wasn't in no 88, 89. Okay, well, this with me and M Rock running around fighting 15 Crips at a motherfucking time. Me, him, baby Sonny. You know what I mean? Shit like that. Like, that's what that was back then. So at the end of the day, and I keep telling these niggas, stop listening to the internet, nigga. If I talk so much shit, if it was a nigga on the streets or anywhere that has some smut on WAC 100, God damn it, that shit would have been Channel 9 News. Every nigga gonna tell you that that nigga been like that all his life. The nigga... M Rock told Lamonte, so I told Lamonte, hey, bro, that ain't no act. Wack been fucked up like that all his life, my nigga. He ain't even like the homies to beat him up as soon as they came in the unit. 
talking about if they can't get out with us, how they gonna get out with the enemy? It's more of them than us. That's what it been. I came up and raised from the savage blood era. The niggas that saw it one way. I don't see it another way. So I don't know why this nigga Ward come in the room talking about whack calling my phone, calling this, 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 this. See, now I got exposure. See, I see. Wack always got some shit to fuck a nigga life up. Now, y'all remember the nigga who was trying to tell me when I was telling him, hey, bro, stop politicking the streets of, of, of the West Coast because you don't know nothing about our streets. And he wanted to argue with me about it, right? Now, I sent. Had a whole room open said it was Wack 100 Coast stripping. He made, he made a whole on. room. Listen, I admit that. Y'all heard me ask the nigga. Name five cents your neighborhood don't get along with in L.A. He couldn't do it, right? He was so fucked up about that, this grown-ass man that's probably 50, that the nigga started texting me. Oh, yeah, whack. I figured out what the other enemies was. Know what I did? I did him a favor and gave him the right list. The nigga started texting me back all kind of fool gazy, weird-ass shit, talking about, Oh yeah, I confuse I I uh I confuse the 18 streets with the Thresses. Motherfucker, 18 streets is Thresses. All Southern United, all Southern Hispanic game is Thresses. Oh, they are, bro. Did you put the shit up? Cause see, now the nigga that pissed me off. I'm to fuck his life up. Did you put the shit up? Is the link up there so everybody can see it up. this nigga? There we go. And I had to educate him on the streets. This nigga saying some fugazi shit. I said, bro, this is why I told you stay out of our street business, bro. When it come to our streets, because you don't know shit about it, but you fronting like, yo, I go out there. You heard? And this is, nah, nigga. You don't even know what the fuck you talking about. You talking about is the northerns and the southerns, they all follow the inmate. No, nigga. Mm -hmm. The northerns and the southerns hate each other. That inmate shit is strictly Sureño. <laughs> Oh, no, I confused the 18th Street with the 13th Street. Ain't no fucking, what are you talking about? B-13, nigga, ain't no, th that, what are you talking about? And see, I kept it, if he'd have just left me the fuck alone, nigga, wasn't nobody calling you, nigga. I called you and asked you, why did you text me how M-Rock doing? As if you know the homie. The homie said, dude, I don't know you. I talked to you on the phone, on the homie Lamonte phone the other day, but I don't know you, my nigga. He told him, War Brim, that's your name? Bro, you talking to a nigga that been knowing me since I've been a kid, bro. You talking to a nigga that we used to live and die together, dog, in, in jails as kids. You can't tell this man. And I told him, look, look, bro, I know Michael Walton. You know him? Nah, who's that? Well, that's M Rod. That's what it says on his birth certificate. You know, you do time with a nigga every day. You know a nigga birthday. You know his allergies. You know what kind of medication he takes. You know what kind of uh, 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 personal, this mama bring you know, you learn everything about a nigga. You do enough time with a nigga. So that nigga needs to bring his ass back up in here. Leave that shit hey, up. Hey, yo, here. whack. He got a room open right now. I bet he look, he know what's yeah. going on. Yo, but it's not. I'm a ping him. Is he supposed yo, to know? I'm, I'm a you ping him. I'm a ping him in here because he got to address this for you. Is he supposed yeah, to know? He got a room right now. He's, he got a room with nine there. people in. He know he know what's up. <laughs> Listen, everybody <laughs> know just in here. that nigga's not gonna run cool this room. The nigga came in the in the clubhouse this morning talking about whack this whack that. Tell whack he won. I won what? Nigga, you called on some fugazi shit. I put the mirror in front of you, and you couldn't face yourself. So wait, what you saying? You saying he not brim? I'm telling you, he fake it. I don't know what he is over there, but all that shit he capping about how he tied in over here, he don't, bro, read that shit up there. He don't even know about the gang culture, bro. Some of these women in here that grew up down here is going to laugh at that shit. I see it. Like, what nigga, like, I said, what? this is why you ain't going to catch whack talking about the woo and the cho and what the fuck. Uh, this over here in Bronx is tripping with this project over here in Hawk. Nigga, I don't hey, know yo, about that shit. But it's, it's, it's West yo, Coast. Wack. Gotti, Gotti, hey, chill. Yo, West Gotti. Said, pull up the Gotti, chill. Let Wack come in here. 
Let let motherfucking um war come and address this shit. Yo, don't say Stack, nothing. he Try don't want to wanna come over here. He said, hey, yo, Gotti, shut the Saturday. fuck up, man. Listen, man, yo, I want Gotti, that chill. Nigga, Let's get. I want that nigga that's coming in and, and tell the people why Wack called your phone. See, that's up there too. You text me talking about how's M Rock doing. I'm like, what you ask me about my homeboy phone, nigga? I called him, bro. What you ask me about M Rock? M Rock said you called him and asked him about you, about me. I said, nigga, you from New York. What am I ask my nigga about you for? You don't count to me out here. Nigga, I went 44 years of my life not never knowing you or seeing you. I could do another 44. Nigga, what the fuck you? Hold on, let me get M Rock on the phone. Hey, Rock, what this nigga talking about? He's saying that I called you, asked him about him. Nigga, you ain't important. We don't know you, nigga. He called me, asked me about Deuce Sales for Food Town Brim, nigga. LA, nigga. Ain't nobody brought your name up, nigga. I don't even know you like that. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, that's... No, what's crazy is you... I said, Rock, the nigga text me, asking me, how you doing? As if... He like, my nigga, you do know I've been doing whack 32 years, right? You do so know I'm me and this nigga go back... Yeah, read, read that the shit, text. Bro. Now, right, this so text X. came the day after I exposed he can't name five enemy sets, but he super brim. That came he, after he don't want to come through. He don't want to come through, Wack. He said, come to Suwu Saturdays. He said he ain't coming. Man, check that. Well, I'm going to read it off. Suwu. Hey, tell him Suwu. That's another Cali word. Nigga. nigga so, hey, let me say this. Hey, hold up for a second, Wack. Let me say this. Nah, because niggas for, playing, me, my nigga, like, I'm going to call a spade a spade. Like, a nigga got the right to say, hey, look, nigga, stay out of certain business that ain't your business because you front, nigga. Like you, you don't know this jungle, nigga. Yo, whack. Know I thought you I thought you ironed this shit out when he apologized to you. Whack. I did too. Wait, wait. I did too. But the nigga called with all this fugazi shit. So hey, I let me. the nigga. Hey, what? That he claimed you know, and every and they and they got at him so aggressive. So aggressive. Nigga, don't bring my name up. Nigga. Hey, what? I've been knowing whack for 32 years, nigga. Who is you? Yeah. Let me reset the room real quick. Hey, welcome to Trolls Nation. If you're new to the room, welcome. This is the Trolls Nation room on the Clubhouse app. If you're on stage or in the audience, you would like to come up. Make sure that you troll up top. Hit the greenhouse. Join the club. Follow the moderators on stage. Did whack so 100. Case war brim off a of clubhouse. So the text message that was sent uh, is a reply to the situation that happened the night before. And pretty much... Uh, uh, War had suggested that the enemy hoods that he left out was all neighborhoods and 18s. And then Wax said, nah, here's five, bro. Neighborhood 60s, 5-9 Hoover, neighborhood 5-5, Menlo, and Florence 13. War said, uh-huh. He said, I got the 18 mixed up with the 13. You are right. Oh, he said, nah. Fuck. He said, nah, 18th Street is one of the biggest Mexican gangs in L.A. 13 represents Sereno, which is Sutrese. All Southern Mexican gangs are Sutrese, uh, short for Southern United Raza. He, uh, he says, Sereno means Southern. I dig it. Somebody got to mute up. And then it says, uh, don't, War says, don't both of them and the Northanios both subscribe to La M.A.? He said, nah, enemies. Sereno click with the L.A., uh, the La M.A. or Mexican Mafia. Mafia Northerner are 14. They hate each other. Two total different movements. He said, yeah, I know the South and the North hate each other. I learned that locked up in Georgia. Then he says, how am Rock doing? That's when yeah, the trigger racer was, came. Now, yeah, right there, he was a clown. See, if that nigga was 19, 21 years old, but nigga, you be in here pumping like, nigga, I'm tapped in. I'm super. Look, bro, that's just like a nigga claiming to be a Muslim and ain't never read the Quran, my nigga. I don't know how to pray and do it some lots of shit, my nigga. Like, stop faking. I be telling niggas, you come around faking around niggas that ain't faking, nigga, you going to be the faker. It's you. Is that his fault, though? I mean, because. No, yeah, that's his niggas... fault. That is not his fault because you know why? He playing a role. He shouldn't. Look, bro, I do not know how to coach soccer. If I go sign up to be the head coach of a soccer team, I'm in violation. Yeah, but the, yeah, up. but niggas stop faking. But the, 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 whoever the G's is that brought that shit to no, his to his no, hood, no, 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 bro, no, 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 bro, no, no. If he don't know it, he be in here faking like he that. See, I'm gonna tell you, and I keep saying this. 
We call a spade a spade over here, bro. We ain't making up no excuses or explanations for no nigga who exposed himself. We catch a nigga digging with his whack. fingers in his ass. Yo, you what? Gonna say whack. you had your fingers in your ass. We ain't gonna say, oh man, because he didn't have no toilet tissue. I don't give a fuck about none of that. He had his fingers in his ass, bro. That's it. Now, what you saying is, well, yeah, we see he don't know what he's talking about. And the excuse for him acting like he know what he's talking about, rewind. The excuse for him acting like he didn't know what he was talking about is his OG when he claimed to be the OG. Let's not t factor that. Take that out. He claims to be the OG. Am I right? Am I right? I don't so know that. No, no, no. Hold up. I don't think he. I don't think he said he was active. See, it's it's bro, different. Bro, bro, bro. I'm not I, active. I don't... I'm not a gangbanger. I just seen my nigga G Perico two hours ago in Frisco walk in Empire with a blue bag down on his face. You know what I did? I hugged my nigga and said, "Good to see you." Not being active means you really supposed to know the culture of what this shit is, because that means you got history with this shit. You got what, years what, in with this shit. What I'm saying is this, whack. Look, look. So I'm, I'm fucking, I'm blessed on villain, right? But I'm connected to the history over there. I don't get involved with the politics over there because I don't oh, know. So, so I, me and I, you I would never have an issue. Me and you would see he does the opposite of what you're saying, bro. That's how he got his ass in some shit. They in here politicking some West Coast shit. And I say, yo, bro, you don't even know what the fuck you talking about. Nigga, what, listen, you don't know what you talking about. You can't politic. He, he coming here. I got offended while Wax said I can't politic the, the West Coast streets. Because you don't know the West Coast streets, nigga. How you going to tell me? Okay. Give me five, neighbor, five of your enemies for your neighborhood out here on the West Coast. Can you tell me the color of the fucking sloths and swap me build, nigga? That nigga got the, um, um, uh, um, that's my point. So how you having an eight-hour room on some West Coast street shit when you don't know nothing about the West Coast streets? That's like me having an eight-hour room on the, the chores and the woos, and I don't know nothing about that shit. What was that, the Jeep, the Jeep room? room? Yeah, yeah, real shit. Yeah, yeah. Fuck out of here. Every, any G, nigga, hey, any G, let me say this right here. Hey, hold on for a second, Wack. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Let, Papa... hold on, let me hold on. let me say this right here, Wack. Now, this Papa, Wack. You know, we 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 chill yesterday for some yeah. a good long time. Yeah, but right since I now, talk to you, my Papa, thing is this: we didn't got the homie on the line, and he, you know, yeah, yeah, I know. No, no, no. Listen, but hear me yeah. out. But hear me out. Now, I feel you one hundred percent because I've also explained to the homies and everybody else on these apps. That you was raised by my general. We raised you. Exactly. Super Bloods raised you. And exactly. so you push one way. That's it. And I explain that to everybody that that don't understand how you push because this is what we embedded in you. And Ain't so no if, if, if now, nigga. exactly. So the whole thing is this. And you know me. I'm y'all, everybody know me. I love everybody. I try to bring everybody together. But at the same token. You know what I'm saying? If you don't know something, you can't speak on it. I agree that's with that one hundred percent. You know what I'm saying? That's why. That's why Stacks just told you what he just said. He from my hood. He from villain, but he don't know the the, the California villain What's politics like that, that so that's he ain't gonna Stax. speak on it. That's What's facts. Oh, facts. Okay. Stacks stone. That's, yeah, yeah. Stax but that, but that's Stacks oh, stone. stone. But now, but now my thing is this, and this is for everybody here ears. Wack is my little homie, whether he banging or not banging. That's my little homie because I know his history. I know his push. I know how he get at. You know what I'm saying? He's a businessman now, but I know how he get down. You know what I'm saying? And so he correct in the whole push, just like I told y'all a few minutes ago. I encourage people to call neighborhoods and question individuals if you don't know who they are. I tell my folks yeah. all the time. Call the villains and ask about me. You know what I'm saying? Because you don't know Lamonte. who I am. I called on Lamonte, and the homie said, no, that's the homie Deuce Hems from Fruit Town, Brim. Whoop, 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 whoop. That's what it was. Oh, okay, he saw, he saw, wacky, he saw. All right, cool. That's it. Now, these niggas don't be knowing, bro, Pop, that um, we when we was doing it, coming from up under y'all, see, that's why I tell niggas, 
ain't no nigga gang banging in our era wasn't going to jail. That's out. Because it was a full-time job, 24 and some more. Non-stop to the casket drop. The mission is to move forward, to get there, meant not to know how far to go. Period. Point blank. Our mentality was, we don't give a fuck if we go to jail. We hear the homies in there showed anyway. We're going to go in there and put some work in. Period. That's all we knew. Nigga didn't know about an airport, about a bank account, about Hello, none of that Rick. shit. Nigga didn't know about none of that shit, bro. So when this nigga come in here talking this shit, talk about, nigga, you, look, bro, you ain't finna tell me, nigga, you gonna politic our streets, nigga. That's out, nigga. It's not happening. All this fake shit you want to talk about and the words you learn, that's cool. I know more words than you. I just don't use them. I speak English. And you know see where the problem arises, he's telling whack like, nah, nigga, I go out there every year for the hood day, like I'm locked in with LA. Oh, like, so I like, like I'm, so so that's that's where the confusion comes because if you locked in and you come out here often, then you gonna know who in you know who your enemies so are. You gonna know all and that. it was just it was just. Yeah, I want I, I want water come I want water come in his room. It's the I reason really, why he was in came here. In his, hey, look. I want him to why. come in the room no, while Wack no, is here. Yo, yo, stack, yo, stack. He said he not coming right. over here. He said niggas is dick riders. I know he ain't coming over here. Yeah, niggas, is, the same nigga that every time I'm in the room, he coming that motherfucker. Every y'all seen it. Back. Every time he mm. come in the room, you know. All yo. of a sudden, you know why that nigga ain't coming in here? Because he know his wife that found that secret cell phone, nigga. That's why I say we we ain't going over. Ain't going over. Wack is like that. Chill, chill, he know. Chill. No, he know because see, he been exposed up top. You be in there talking like you know all this street shit about out here, and and the homie, the homie pop out no boy nigga say, oh I confuse 18th Street with 13th Street, nigga you sound so much like a fucking clown, my nigga. Like nigga, you should stop. Yeah, the only, the only, the only, the only Thirteenth Street is the F 13s and you can't, you're not gonna confuse them because they, they don't want got a letter in front of. Them. That's it. So That's you know, I, yeah. and see, this is the thing. Me, me personally, now me, I don't trip that. See, that, that's my thing. Me, I don't trip that. I let it go. Now, whack on the other hand, him nah. and the homies, his and the homies from his generation nah, won't let yeah. that go. They nah. pick Yo, up on little stuff like that Lamonte. all the time. Lamonte, what's going on, Lamonte? Let us. That's hey, who I hey. call. Look, that's who I called on. I called on him, and the homie said, "That's the homie from Fruit Town Brim. Blood is solid." And once I heard that, it was done. I said, "Well, shit, I, I'm never gonna question him in life." I get off the phone. Next thing I know, this nigga Ward texting me, talking about how it's M Rock. I call him. Hey, bro, why you ask me about no, M-Rock? Please don't M-Rock. say the homie name on here, Wack. Please listen, don't no, say that. Homie don't. Hey, bro, me and that nigga go back 32 years. Yeah, bro. I, listen, he, he, he do, told me, he, war, Wack, he told me about y'all doing time and all that about five, but, ten years ago he told me about that. Okay, so I've been knew this, that. right? This nigga hits me, said, well, you know, Rock tell me you called him asking me, uh, asking questions about me. I said, nigga, you a motherfucker lie. Hold on, Rock, get on the phone. Rock, what this nigga talking about? Who that? Ward. Talking about, say what you said. Yeah, you know, uh, you know, you told me that uh, Wack called you. He said, first of all, I ain't told you shit, nigga. I don't know you like that. And Wack called, asked about the homie Deuce Sims, and that's it. Your name, nigga, you ain't relevant in our conversation, my nigga. Who is you? You know how Rocky is. He ain't. Nigga, who is you? Nigga, what the fuck you lying for? I told Wack who the homie was, and Wack say shit, okay, that's that's it. Ain't no more question, no homie. And we off the line. Where you getting this from? He say, oh, that's crazy. Niggas is lying to me. We said, are you insinuating that Lamonte told you that M-Rock told you we asked about you? Is that what you saying? Uh, I know what I'm going to do with niggas. I'm just going to stay in my lane. I said, well, we told you to do that a long time ago. He get off See, this is what I do. Watch this here. This is what I did. Ever since I've been on this app, every blood that I encounter in every key way that I encounter. What I do is I run my checks. I check them out because I don't <laughs> like to interact people with people if I don't get to know them, if I don't know them. 
know what I'm saying? So what I do is I holler at these cats on this yard with me, whether they keyways or homies, and I call the streets. And matter of fact, this is the cold part about it. Rika, Rika, Rika tell you this, me and Rika, we didn't have sidebars before, and I told Rika, I hollered at some of the big homies Facts. from Denver Lane. Facts. Because that's Facts. that's that's just how I get out. Not because I'm questioning a person, but I like to know who I interact with. Because I because me, I don't you know, I don't I don't I don't hold no punches and my life is an open book, but I like to interact with people that are like minded people. So so listen, so this what drove the call by Lamonte. Somebody say, Whack, Lamonte really from Brim? I say, Well, I don't know the homie say from Brim. Why you ask that? They say, Well, somebody told us. The nigga like live up north. I said, well, just because he live up north don't mean he ain't from Brim, but hold on. Let me call the homie. If the homie, the homie don't know. So you know what the whoop? Yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, okay, yeah. He a Brim. If that nigga, you know, he, he spoke highly of that man, he ain't going to do that. He a Brim. No matter where he live, we got homies live every motherfucking where. That's how niggas just turned out everywhere. You know, that don't mean he ain't, you know what I'm saying? So that's what that is. I don't well, know where the fuck well, Ward can well, get well, listen, in Well, listen, as far as the nigga. shit, as far as the shit with Ward, that's something you and him got to talk about, right? No, nah, bro, think that we talked about Don't it, talk. Bro, nah, huh? uh, he came in the room this morning. Yeah, he, he got off the deck with me and motherfucking the homie, and the homie checked his nuts. Hey, nigga, you ain't going to tell my nigga he asked me something about you, nigga. We don't even know you, nigga, to be talking about you. Who is you? He asked about the homie, nigga, not your name. Oh, that's crazy. That's crazy. Okay, well, we clear that up? Yeah, what? Well, my bad. Okay, I'm off the jack. Next thing I know, he in the room talking about this nigga whack yeah. blowing my phone up. I had to block him, and he calling around, asking niggas about me. Hold up, nigga. Yeah, he, he, yeah, he said, whack said that I was on three-way with him at 12 midnight calling war phone. We didn't call that nigga well, phone at no 12 right, midnight on no three-way. Well, 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 war got well, the room that, started though. right now, right? War nah, can well, speak for himself, was, right? War got the room here. started right now. I can't speak for him. So, huh? Lamonte, hold on. Here. Lamonte, while you're here, can you clarify what you were saying in the back channel about that room? Remember what you said? Like, man, y'all got a misunderstanding about the G Perico room that y'all was really trying to uh, give people the awares of being in the gang. Can you can you explain that? Because a lot of people not, still fuck up about being, that room. Not being aware. Well, well, just just what what Wag mad at this nigga about? It is he guilty of the same shit, right? That he come over there to support us because he come bounce over there here and there, but he doesn't understand that. Me and the boy Stats 280 whole focus was to focus on positivity within our, within our community. We both liked the G Perico, and our point was, let's show these kids how ugly it really is, what their expectations really is. Hopefully, that'll have a couple of them be like, nah, I don't want to join them gang, right? That's the narrative we came with on positivity and building. Until he you start calling a nigga a buster and he can't. Listen, 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 whack, 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 whack. As I far bet as that nigga ain't gonna stand on a, on eleven deuce and call him a buster. You know that. Hey, I hey, bet he ain't gonna well, do that. well, first and foremost, a nigga be a fool to go to another man hood to disrespect him, especially. Oh, but I go to, I go, I, I go, I go to the, uh, I go to the eleven deuce Broadways and, and especially the five deuce. I'm good over there though. But look, yeah, yeah, as yeah, far yeah. as as far as as far as that, I didn't never said he's a buster. I don't know the man. Nah, right? niggas was in there. Listen, I'm gonna niggas tell you was what was said. Dude, listen, nobody, a buster. Listen, nobody said. I'm glad that he, he he. Listen, the matter of fact, the G homie Popeye could, could could pretty much clarify that, right? What we were saying was the expectations from a gangbanger standpoint, which I don't know if you fully aware of. An active gangbanger. I didn't caught rival enemies who then had that burner to their head and they was really prepared to die. You know what I'm saying? And that's what they expect because they put their life on the line. So if these kids ain't ready and prepared to do that, then they don't need to be joining it to getting up in these streets. That's our narrative. When you came, you thought that we hey, was bro. awesome. He's hey, a buster. Today I would have did the I same did, thing. I didn't I didn't even respond to nothing until I heard niggas calling him a buster because that's some real super super shit for a nigga but, to tell me. But it's what? Real easy everybody for a nigga gonna to have their opinion, right? And one of the homies. I'm gonna be real. 
We do yeah. that in another room. This on that's War Brim, nigga. Fuck that. I ain't taking it off of him. He kicked this off this morning on Paro. Blood All right. in there. What All right, well, name? we, well, well, we in the other room. If you really want to talk to nah, 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 nah. He know where we at. He always come to the room where my name is at. He know where we at. We deep as a motherfucker over here, my nigga. Come I mean, on, everybody gonna here. follow. Everybody gonna follow you if you follow you if you go over there. Son. Nah, fuck that nigga. Room. His room he don't win like shine. that. He don't win like that, my nigga. I'm a boss. He don't win. He ain't nobody. I'm here to let niggas know he ain't nobody. You been faking. You an imposter. You claim you this. You don't even know nothing about the game culture. I put your motherfucking text messages up. You sound like a, a an idiot. You don't know shit about shit, and you need to stay in your lane, nigga. I embarrassed you that day. Well, nigga, name five of your enemy sets. You couldn't do it. You take it fucked with you so much. You text me back hours later, still trying to name them. I had to just give them to you. Here, nigga, take some. Here go a few. Here, nigga. Nah. Yeah. He damn. know what's going on. It's up here, <laughs> nigga. Yeah, straight up, nigga. That's crazy. Just like me talking about I'm a fucking Muslim and I can't recite nothing. I don't know none of the prayers. He catfish I, don't even know, I don't even know. Yeah, that nigga War Brim is catfish. And since he a homie, we're going to call him a batfish. There we go. <laughs> batfish. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> he said a bat. Listen, so this is what I'm going to do. No, this is what I'm going to do. No. I'm giving him what he gave me. He got the morning. I got the evening. Tomorrow when I wake up, I'm cool. I hear him with my name in his mouth. I got some more shit on him. I'm telling you. Everybody know when I say I got some shit. I got some shit. I'm going to flare his ass up again. He best leave me the fuck alone, bro. Because I am who I am. The fuck you call the name. The good I call it like that. Make it run and make on people. You got to run and make on any. Yeah, I am who I am. Now, I don't know about this nigga. Talking about the 18 and the 13 and the this and the that and the this. Nigga, that's not any Brim I know understands their gang culture. You should just say, I'm from Brim, from New York. Stop pumping, nigga. I'm connected, tied in. I know my shit. I know this. I know that. Shut the fuck up. You don't. Can I ask a nigga. question? Sick. Should have left my name out of his mouth this morning knowing that the homie set you straight. You called me. I didn't call you with that shit, nigga. You hit me with that shit. I got to ask you a question, right? Yeah, ask me what you want to ask me. So, um, like, this is what I want to ask you. Like, so do you feel like niggas on the East Coast shouldn't be repping West Coast sets? That's why I'm confused. Nah, that's listen, not what hey, you're listen, saying, bro. homie. Hey, listen, bro. I don't know if niggas is on charm. Niggas was born two months early. I don't know, bro. But listen, my nigga. I don't, I'm not a drunk. I don't slur my speech. My nigga, I say what the fuck I say. You worse than the district attorney, my nigga. You so trying people, to so you, so you, he so basically saying be who you be. So you think That's people on you think people on the West Coast know all the knowledge about the West Coast about the sex they rap? You oh, think none of the little homie? Right, you think you none of the little homie? Hey, bro, hey, bro. Are you slow? You didn't hear me say, nigga. Ain't no West Coast niggas supposed to be in no room. Talking about the blocks of fucking New York. Talking about the wolves and the chose right, and this. Right. No, that's, that's not what I'm saying. Nah, nah, nah. Hold on. What the fuck that's not you what saying? Right, right. West Coast niggas saying. know their history, man. Said, West Coast dude, niggas know. So, so up, you said man, every. I'm saying, do you think every little nigga that's banging on the West Coast know their history? Because this niggas who bang, get yeah. brought home. Listen, don't know hey, listen. History. Let me tell yeah. you something. Let me tell you something. First of all, I don't like how you trying to change the narrative. I'm telling you, an old nigga that's his age, what he supposed to know if he say he know it? We ain't talking about no little niggas. But my little homies, oh, they know who their enemies is, nigga. Any little crip nigga, any little paru nigga, blood nigga, they know who the fuck their enemies is. Because you know what the yeah. first thing, you know what the first thing they doing? They run around with spray paint, crossing them out on the walls anyway. They know that we going to jail. We fighting our enemies. Niggas is killing their enemies.
That's the what fact. What the fuck you well, saying, I, my nigga? I, well, I'll tell you out here on the East Coast, niggas, some niggas don't know their history and they bang it. They well, I don't know. They that still ain't my business. I ain't. That's I how niggas I'm just saying, a lot of little niggas just that wild. They don't give a fuck but, about but, it. But we ain't they talking about a little nigga, though. Yeah, but niggas. talking about a little nigga? That's the point. That's the point. And you talking about East Coast again. It's not even that they don't know. It's the arrogance that come with that. Let me tell you why your argument, yo, yo. Yo, 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 Kev, look, let me tell you why what you're saying holds no validity to the conversation, right? The reason why this, what you saying holds no validity is this, right? It don't matter where you banging at. If you're from somewhere, you're supposed to know your enemies. And so what you saying, it holds zero validity. validity yes, it does, because niggas be getting bullshit food on, on every coast. Nigga, that's what I'm trying to tell you. I know niggas. Nah. I know. I know niggas that was not on your stuff. enemies. You know your no, in your enemies, no, or you know no, your enemies. Listen, nah, stop, stop. Listen, stop. That's it happens. Nigga niggas crazy. get bullshit. Niggas get bullshit paperwork. Nah, I'm not. Yo, hold on, hold on, hold on. Nah, we not. Let me say something. Let me say something. Let me say something. Let me Let me give you. Let me give you. Let me give you a universal. Let me give you a universal answer. What Wack was saying, because I see people. They they miss. They they don't hear him because y'all not listening to him. What he's telling you is this. The man is a grown man. Look, I'm 55 years old. If I don't know my enemies in my neighborhood, it's a problem. Right. Now, if I'm, if, I'm, if I'm 17, 18, 19 years old, I don't know it. It's not a problem because it's, it's my job to learn it. An OG is a person at a certain stature, a certain age. When you become an OG, it's your job to teach the youngsters their history, so they're going to know these things. Because all the youngsters ain't going to go to the YAs and, and all this. They're going to spray paint on the wall. They're going to do all that old type of stuff. But what he's saying is this. Brim is of a certain age. And his age is supposed to give him enough wisdom to learn about the neighborhood that he's representing. Even if you don't go to Cali, if you from villain, and I sit and I ask you a couple of questions, it, just like what Wack asked. If I sit back and ask a villain who your enemies are, and he can't tell me, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to question who who groomed him. I'm going to tell him, listen, don't claim the hood until you know the hood. Then I'm going to go to the motherfucker that, that, that allegedly taught him, allegedly schooled him, and tell him, wait, hold up. You need to go back to school because evidently you don't know something or you're not telling him. And if you ain't telling him, then you're not giving him everything he needs to be out there in the society. So he shouldn't and speak. This, that's my Yo, Papa, point. Let me add on to, to that. Hold on, hold, hold on, on, Papa. Let me add on to that as, as a blood Hold on, let's stack, let's stack speak. Hold on, hold on, one hold on. mic. Hold on, hold on. Mic, let me tell you, mic, let me keep it 100 mic. with everybody, right? So I'm a bloodstone villain from the East, right? So I didn't know history while I was banging, while I was in there, right? I didn't know no history from the Bloodstone Villains on the West. But when I got out and I started getting in tune with Bloodstone Villains, because I want to know what the fuck the Bloodstone... I'm going to keep it 100 with you. The reason why we jacked the Bloodstone Villain name, because we read about it and the shit sounded hot, right? So I didn't know nothing else. But I'm the seventh Bloodstone Villain in the East Coast. You, you could do a resume on me. And I know everything about the New York history, but I was intrigued about the West Coast history. So I got in tune. Every time I hear about a motherfucker from the villains, I want to get in tune with that nigga. You know what I'm saying? I, so war's not here. I can't back the nigga because, first of all, I'm not in Brim fucking business. I'm a, I'm a villain. You feel me? So he got to be here. He got to fucking be here and stand up to the shit he was saying. And that's a fact. You know what I'm saying? That, and, and then, then more importantly, like you, you don't, you don't call like as a man, bro. Like nobody should call nobody name if you ain't really tapped in with that person. I think that's another thing that people missing that, like, and, and, and that's the homie. That's the. Fool. I don't name drop nobody, homie. I'm just saying that. What I'm just keep saying is not an East Coast thing, but what I'm saying is it's niggas on the East Coast that bang West Coast sets that don't got the right knowledge. I know that's for a, a problem. Fact. 
Right, yeah, that's all I'm but, yeah, about, hold on, hold on. Yeah, hold on, but that's on, not one mic, one mic, Yo, one Kev, mic, that's not that's hold on, hold on, hold on, yes, hold on. Hold on, let me speak. But this all but hold on, this hold on, hold on. This all derives from him speaking on what a nigga from Broadway should have did on a hundred and eighth and fig. This all derives from him speaking, saying, Oh no, nah, niggas should have did this or should have did that. And then this is what the conversation led to. Wax said, Y'all can't speak on West Coast politics. Eastern District cannot speak on West Coast politics. So war came the next day saying yeah man i want to talk to him i've been calling him i want to know what he meant by that i just heard that part of the clip i didn't even watch the whole thing because i wasn't there but what do you mean that we can't speak on west coast politics and then he was questioned about who his enemies in la was and didn't know so whack was proving the point man that while you speaking on broadways and dlbs and 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 and, and saying that y'all should be able to speak on that in that room you don't know nothing about the white yeah, why can't, 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 but that's the point. With why I can't, nigga, the same reason why I, I can't go talk about why the you do though. No, 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 you I don't I talk about y'all street. You, you talk about you lie, nigga. You was talking about you, 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 you talking about anybody. No, I'm not. Jim Jones is not the streets. Yeah, Jim Jones is not. You don't talk about the streets. Jim Jones, but you talk about the streets. Yes, but 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 I ain't never talked about y'all blocks, nigga. Uh, yeah, yeah, you talking about neighborhoods. You talking about neighborhoods. But I'm talking about in the room. That day when you came in the room, I was in there. You was mad because they was talking about the nigga G Perico. And what I'm saying to you is they was not talking like he was a buster. It was people in the crowd that was saying that. But you, man, you know that's, nigga, you go not, in any of these, you go in any of these rooms, you know niggas is a hey, bro, say look, some check shit. this out. Check this out, bro. Listen, if you is you wore Brill, are you talking like you, you know? You from Brill? Nah, I'm nah, just I'm, not brand brand. I'm just I'm just speaking. Okay, then me and you ain't got me and you ain't got nothing to talk. Me and you ain't got nothing to talk. I was about, I wasn't bro. talking to you, I was talking in the room. So you ain't gotta speak if you don't want to. I'm just hey, keeping it real. Me and you ain't got nothing to hey, talk hey, about, nigga. You don't want to ask I'm me telling a question. You, you came in the room when I was in there. I saw what happened. You came in and thought niggas was trying to play old boy and they wasn't. You said stats was talking shit. You said Levante was saying this and that. nobody wasn't saying that. That was other people. Hey yo, homie, crowd. nigga, you just sat chasing. there and said niggas was you just hey, sat hey, there yo. and said hey, hey, bro, hey, yo, niggas was talking. Stats was like clout was chasing, Kev. He was clout chasing. Come all on, right? bro. He was hating on a man. He was hating on a man that he don't know, bro. He got a fucking rap career trying to push, bro. He was clout chasing. I mean, the since I've been on the nigga, app, he don't know. Talking. He not from Cali. He he not official dude from Jersey, you know. So come on, my nigga. He was sitting on a nigga bed, bro. Come on, he was sitting Listen, on another nigga bed, licking his lips. The nigga's a weirdo, bro. Yeah, yo, got it. Yo, got it. Too. Nigga's a fucking weirdo, lie, man. Hey, come on, man. Hold on, hold on, real quick, got it. Can I say something real quick, y'all? Real, real quick, man. I just want to correct him. I just, I just want to correct him. Yo, Kev, when you say, when you say what you're saying, right? The reason why I'm disagreeing with you when you said that you got a lot of bloods on the East Coast that don't know. Uh, proper paperwork. The reason why I'm going to tell you you forced on that, especially when you had, because you had a hat that was out here a few years ago named YG that connected himself with all of the West Coast, and he was trying to connect all the hats here on the East Coast with the. He was trying to do an East Coast West Coast connection. So, bro, when he started doing that, he was the one bringing information from Cali to New York to the hats. So, if you was hat at that time, it was a lot of information that was given that you should have known. Like, no, you should. And that's why not. I say what you're saying is not all the way true because. All right, there, so you say hey, every up, homie, up. you think every homie know they every homie know they paperwork. No, no, I'm not. I'm they not saying the, every homie, homie, but I'm saying that's, the homies that that's what I'm the saying. homies that's Maybe my age and older. The paperwork? Hold on, y'all going to do back with through some shit that really because it don't matter. At the end of the day, if you if you got different mobs talking, right, and let, we could be in a joint. It don't really matter. It could be five different games. If you if you in some kind of violation. You supposed to show up to the session, bro. Take That's your me and Stacks just your... said the same shit. Hold on, hold on. You're right, you're right. Take your violation, be a man about it. I don't think that take anything away from whatever his rep in New York is. At the end of the day, you know, you might have spoke on some LA business that you shouldn't have. You learn a lesson. Take your violation and be be a man yeah, about the shit. He was supposed to be present. He was supposed to be present. You know, all, that, all this, you know, motherfuckers trying to make shit confusing and defend them. Let him, you know what I'm saying? Let him take his violation. That's all, really. 
Anything else is really like ridiculous. He was supposed, he was supposed to be here he for this to wow. He was supposed to stand right up for himself. Yeah. And he didn't. He didn't, and that so just basically what we're going is exactly. well, I'm not saying, about standing up for yourself. It's about taking that violation, bro. If you if you been found in violation, you been found in violation. I just Can don't I understand people act like Wack don't quick. go in these rooms and be in, in, inserting himself into business on the East Coast. It don't matter what it is. It's East Coast shit. It don't well, y'all niggas. And see, this, 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 this is the reason. East Coast versus West Coast shit. No, 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 no. Hey, no, 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 most of them gangs, and this ain't no to be offensive, is out of order, bro, because where's the discipline? When a nigga do something, right, the mob meets up, he get charges, if he found guilty in a sense, they weigh on it, and you get a violation. But you can't catch a violation if you don't fucking show up. And then... Then you ain't no fucking member if you don't show up. How you gonna be a member? That's when we label you for of anything. You know what I'm saying? Of anything, nigga. You could be, I don't give a fuck what it is. You think the FOI, if one of their members do some bullshit and they don't show up to get disciplined, what you think they gonna do to them? To they take them out. They exile them. Who is hey, let me say this real quick to Reek. Hey, Reek. Hey, Reek. Oh, Y'all making it about East Coast, yeah, it's out of order, bro. No, Come on. Okay, no, what I'm gonna say, hey, T Rose. Yeah, hey, I'm gonna be real quick. Wait, no, wait, wait. Who that said I came in here and made it East Coast, West Coast? I'm addressing war. Nah, he didn't. He didn't. He didn't. Call, he didn't. We're not gonna do this today. We're not gonna do Yo, this. Yo, who the fuck? Black wasn't in the, the wrong. Who the, from the, who the fuck from the East Coast is saying that? He addressing war. That was the nigga. That was the nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're not doing that. that. We're not doing that. Like Wack said. Wack Wack said. He's not here speaking about blue and chose shit. He's not here speaking about what Chef G and the work that these niggas in Brooklyn is putting in. He's speaking about public records, Jim Jones and Six Nine. That's not fucking New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Public record. We gotta separate this shit now, man. I don't agree with hold everything on, Wax says and does. Hey, let me let me let me say this real quick. Dudes, hold on, hold on, dudes. Let the let the big homie pop. Hey, no, what I was gonna say was this. Is what I was gonna say, uh, uh, T Rose, down in the audience, we got a homegirl down in the audience named Carolyn. And matter of fact, Wax Wax know of her. Yeah, I'm bringing her right if he don't know her. Carolyn, uh, and, uh, I'm sorry. No, no, her name is yeah, exactly. That's her. And I want y'all to pull her up because the reason why I said it is this. She's one of, if not the most reputable brim on the West Coast female. She more reputable than a whole lot of men. She, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to let her. There she go. She hey, you got the flow. Bubbles, go ahead and introduce yourself and say what you say. You know. How do it? Can you guys hear me? Yeah, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Hey, good, good evening to all of you guys, you know. Thanks, my mind. How you doing, Wax? Um, I've been listening to this, and, and, and it's kind of disturbing. For one, Wax is straight on point. It, it's so many, and, and, and there's no disrespect to the East Coast, but I've been caught in a lot of bullshit in the middle with people from the East Coast because... They don't know what they're talking about. Some of them, no disrespect to you guys that are on the phone, but they'll say something or they'll think something and then they'll run and they'll tell somebody else and that somebody else think they're telling them history when they don't know what the hell they're talking about. Another thing is um, they get to throwing out names like, like Wack was saying, this little youngster did. I'm assuming he's a youngster because I'm an old lady. So, um, he he get to spitting out names. Wag knew who he was talking about. So that I, I said that to say one of my homeboys, man, Ronald, just got caught up. And, and and it's from the same kind of shit. People getting on the phone, they don't know their history, or they internet banging. You know what I'm saying? For me, if you want to talk to me or you want to talk about some West Coast shit, you're gonna have to catch a flight and come over here. For one. I don't talk to nobody no more that's on another coast. 
with us, with Wack, with Popeye, we family. That I mean, this West Coast shit, we we, we here, and, and and I agree. It's it, it's stay in your lane, stay in your lane, and, and then for the disrespect, and I understand too what the little brother was saying about what if they're not fed correctly. He knew he wasn't fed correctly when he said it. If he couldn't say who the fuck his enemies was, that was a sure sign right there that he wasn't fed. And then the call back a couple of hours later and still trying to figure it out. No, you were supposed to know your history before you done it. And so many people say they know people. They got my name back there in paperwork. And I was hot about it. Like, I don't want my name in no East Coast paperwork. There is such thing called a RICO Act. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers is getting sent to the federal penitentiary. So if you don't know what you're talking about, stay your ass off the line until you find out what you're talking about. And therefore, G's like, what? Ain't got to go through this. So like the homie said, he needs to step up to the plate, admit his wrong, take his violation, and keep it moving. And that's all basically what I have to say, because the back and forth is bullshit. And then how is he going to go back and forth with a reputable G that's from California? That know his shit, that's been pushing the shit, like he said, 30 some years. Just to go back and forth with a well-known brother, that's disrespecting itself. And the other thing I don't understand is how... It, it, it has always puzzled me. They got OGs and triple OGs and, and Wax said something about uh, correct me if I'm wrong. The dude say he an OG. You an OG? How how they get to OG and triple OG and all that stuff? Over here in California, we got to do at least 20 years to be a G. So that's another thing about the East Coast. How is a East Coast OG that probably been internet banging or on the phone banging for four years don't step up to a real G that been in the trenches I don't understand it but but that's just my take on it well I can speak New York we become OGs when you putting in work in the pen I don't know about war like that you know what I'm saying I don't know about war when I was in the pen but I know the OGs over here that put in that work fighting police uh, going against the ops, that's how we became OGs over here. Right. Like, we put in work to get that title. So, I don't know about war like that. He got to come in this room and he got to speak for himself. And he got to speak for his history. But I know about this villain shit. And I know about the first part of UBN shit. You know what I'm saying? Right. And I know when the, when the villain... And I know when the villains separated, they suffered from the UBN. We was the first set to leave the UBN. So, I know about all the OGs in, in the East Coast. I know that for a fact, and we deserve our OG titles. Yeah, I've been banging 25 years. You know what I'm saying? So I got OG status, and I know about all the history over here on the East Coast. I could speak on that. Do I know about history of the West Coast? Hell no. But I'm in tune with the villains over there, and they tell me some shit. And I'm I'm intrigued by it. So I want to know where the fuck my sex But now look at those Stack Stone. Stack Stone, let me say this. Let me say this, because I don't want you to be confused. And like I say, I, uh, if I'm going to correct anybody when I feel they wrong, and, and I'm saying this to say this to you, first and foremost, villains never had anything to do with UBNs. Never. 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 That's, they, they never came. It's never. Ever, ever, ever. Secondly, the UBNs that people learning about out there is totally different than the original UBNs. It's they, they've been miseducated on what UBN is. And so, once again, Villains never in the history of villains ever had a connection with UBN. Oh, oh neither. Co I can't speak. No, no I can't no, speak. I, I have, can't speak about no, the East Coast. I can't. I can't East speak. Coast, they they started. Yeah, we, UBN on the East Coast had nothing to do with UBN on all. the West Coast. But what I'm when I spoke about. When I spoke about UBN, I'm talking about East Coast UBN when OG Mac bought that shit over here, <laughs> right? That's all I'm talking about. And then I'm talking about when Bloodstone Villain <laughs> East, we, we left the niggas UBN. Y'all you know? Can I say something real quick? I don't even know the magic hey, uh, that shit is. Y'all be saying that. Now, that really fucks with me because that what that is and what y'all saying it is, 
It's two total different Can things. I we understand that now, Wack. Well, you got to understand we got this from somebody who brung the shit over here. We jumped on the movement because we was being oppressed over here. I know, but I mean, my whole thing was about War Brim. My, look, for one, y'all trying to turn this into something. What? That nigga came into a room and totally ignored the fact that you called me with some shit and I got the homie on the phone and checked your ass on the phone. And I left it alone. Hey, hey, yo, what? I think but, but. I think you and him should get on. I think you and him should get on the phone and chop it up. No, he, no. Came, he came in here. Listen, bro, the nigga came in here and said, "I blocked his number." I'm confused because once I get the homie on the phone, I'm letting them holler. He like, "Hey, homie, why can't you mention your name? We don't talk about you. You ain't even from out here, my nigga." We was talking about the, the homie from Fruit Town Brim, my nigga, and it, it was just whack was getting some clarity on if the homie. Was who we was, and that was it. Why you get well, you know, he told me whack called you asking me questions. Now nah, you just told I see you just told me you talked to the homie direct and he told you that. M Rock go go left. Nigga don't lie on my name. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He cleared up. You know what? Hold on, you weird ass. It was just whack was getting some on the phone. Back hey, uh, that shit is. Y'all be saying that now that really fucks with me because what that is and what y'all saying it is, is two total different things. We understand that now, Wack. Well, you got to understand we got this from somebody who brung the shit over here. We jumped on the movement because we was being oppressed over here. I know, but I mean, my whole thing was about War Brim. My, look, for one, y'all trying to turn this into something. Wait, that nigga came into a room and totally ignored the fact that you called me with some shit and I got the homie on the phone and checked your ass on the phone. And I left it alone. Hey, hey, yo, what? I think, but, but, I think you and him should get on. I think you and him should get on the phone and chop it up. No, he, no. Came, he came in here. Listen, bro. The nigga came in here and said, "I blocked his number." I'm confused because once I get the homie on the phone, I'm letting them holler. He like, "Hey, homie, why can't mention your name? We don't talk about you. You ain't even from out here, my nigga." We was talking about the, the homie from Fruit Town Brim, my nigga, and it, it was just whack was getting some clarity on if the homie. Was who we was, and that was it. Why you get well? You know, he told me whack called you asking me questions. Now nah, you just told I see you just told me you talked to the homie direct and he told you that. M Rock go go left. Nigga, don't lie on my name. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He cleared up. You know what? I'm in the wrong this, that, and other. Okay, we clear, we clear. I get off the jack. He coming in the room the next morning, talking about I blocked your nigga whack. He he calling around about me. Hold on, you weird ass nigga. You the one making the call. And now you niggas talking about I need to get on the phone. He the one said he blocked my number. I don't need this nigga for nothing. Nigga, yeah, 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 yeah. What nah, I need you can't, you for? Yeah, Vella, he can't. You, you can't start on the stage and then ask to go in the back. Nah, you can't. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, 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 nah. No, no. I'm one of nah, I'm one of the first people in the room that said he gotta call, he gotta take accountability because you don't call no nigga name that you definitely not that you don't fuck with. He don't acknowledge you. I never get on no. I'm not never gonna call no nigga name who who don't know me, don't know me for putting in no dub, none of that. But when I say that's because if I understand anything correctly about War, he got a special case dealing with like like, like the way he came about into the the old lot shit was a, a, a little bit different. So I think if I, if I'm if I'm mistaken, if I'm not mistaken, he switched his heart. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I said the guy get on the phone so him and Wack, um, so Wack can get an understanding of who he is. And, like he switched his hood. I'm not making no excuses though. Bro, you know bro, you right, you bro, right. Whatever but he hood been in is it? Room. Whatever hood it is, where's the discipline, bro? Hey, Wack, this creep. Go, go, uh, go check your text message that I sent you. Yeah, because I mean, Nigga, I'm gonna get on. I'm a, I mean, I'm gonna get on his ass though. Nigga, I ain't letting that shit. No, he said he blocked me. He said he blocked me. How, how I'm gonna get on the phone? If I can make yeah, a I, 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 don't, I don't, I don't got nothing bad to say about War Brim on a personal tip. I'm just saying, where's the discipline? Because he, because he, because he, he can actually, like I said, he, you know, take his, take his lumps like a man and and move on from the shit. Fuck. But niggas keep making niggas keep saying. Hold on, hold on. Every every time, every time somebody say something, it's all about we didn't get taught right, or we didn't know this, or we didn't know that, bro. Oh, but man. you do know what discipline is, right? So I'm asking, where is the discipline? 
in whatever you're doing. I mean, I don't really care if it was Black Panthers, bro. Where's the discipline, bro? Any organization got to have some kind of form of discipline, bro, if you want to be reputable to other organizations. So, you know, so we I, do I have a discipline see... system here, though. We do have that. Uh, well, it, if we I can, do. Okay. If I can interject. Hey, niggas, niggas over there actively right. running a smear campaign on WAC right now with, with, with PTRs and all this so weird shit. When niggas could have came right here, they, you know, niggas didn't want the smoke in here. Niggas went over there and doing that shit over there. Uh, you know, Lamonte was just on stage. I don't know why he went over there and now it's something different, but, um, hey, welcome to Trolls Nation. If you're new to the room, welcome. This is the Trolls Nation room on the Clubhouse app. If you're on stage or in the audience would like to come up, make sure that you troll up top, hit the greenhouse, join the club, follow the moderators on stage, did whack 100, chase war brim off a of Clubhouse. Does he got him chucking and jiving? Do we got him bouncing from room to room? Do we got him? That's a fact he ran into that for whack. Hey, he was here. He was here Chucking at first. He up against the he ropes. Was, he was here at first telling T-Rose, boom this shit. Boom this shit. Boom Down it. Goes Frazier. <laughs> he told yeah. T-Rose to boom it. <laughs> this is bullshit. Boom this motherfucking room. Well, yo, Rick, I thought Wolf. T-Rose, T-Rose said, I ain't shit. I ain't got nothing. I ain't booming nothing. T-Rose said, I ain't moving nothing. Hey, yo, hey, yo, <laughs> hey, yo, Rick, I thought Wolf was official. He said he ran with Mob Deep and all these niggas in the village. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, this is the thing. This is the thing, bro. We don't care about who official on here, bro. Fuck all that, bro. That's why, that's why you That's why you, you, you speak on, you do what you do on this app. You do that, bro. When you get all into the other shit, you get situations like this where niggas is pulling your card, niggas get to asking you questions because you, you did too much, bro. Yeah, it's not a good look. You did look. too much, bro. It's not a good look. You don't know. Man, I, I never believe these niggas. You did too much. Niggas came in here and created a name. Nigga created a name like War Brim. What a deep voice. Make the fuck out of here, nigga. He got some. Uh, hold, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. One mic, one mic. One mic. Let me say something, though, because I don't think, I think people don't really realize what Wack was saying to initially overall, right? You from somewhere, you repping, you repping the banner, right? Like, not for nothing else, bro, for your own safety. You got to know who your enemies are, bro. You can't be moving around saying, war brim, I'm just brim this, that, and you nigga, you walk right into a nigga knock you across your fucking head because you ain't know that shit. you wasn't supposed to be over here talking no brim shit. Like, you, like, you got to know who your enemies is, bro. If you waving a flag or something, like, like, you just got to know that piece of information, bro. Real talk. Like, I mean, I don't give a fuck if you don't know nothing else, but you got to know that, boy. Real talk.